Hey everybody, Movie Fan Z here. So I have the last four movies in the Harry Potter franchise to review for you since the last time I've done a review. So let's get to the first one of those. And that is film five in the series, and that is Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix from 2007. So the plot from IMDb, when their warning against Voldemort uh, returned, or when the warning against Voldemort's returned is scoffed at, Harry and Dumbledore are targeted by the wizard authorities as an authoritarian bureaucrat slowly seizes power at Hogwarts. So... With this one, if this is to me. This is in the mid, like this is a middle of the road movie. Uh the thumbs up that I did like is the new characters that you get. You get Imelda Staunton as Dolores Umbridge, who everybody is not a fan of, and I can understand why after rewatching this movie. You got Ivana Lynch as Luna Lovegood. And you got the uh, debut of Helena Bonham Carter as Bellatrix Lestrange, who actually has a connection to Neville. But also returning, you get Gary Oldman returning as Sirius Black, you get Brendan Gleeson returning as Mad-Eye Moody, and you get David Thewlis returning as Remus Lupin. So that's, to me... It, like I said, it's in the middle of the road. The The Order of the Phoenix part was weird. But uh, but that's kind of what leads me into the thumbs down. It's like, other than the new characters, it's not a great story. It's okay, but it's not one that really wows you. So, overall, I'm going to give this a two and a half. Like I said, right in the middle. But that is my review for 2007's Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. Come back next time for another review. It's Movie Fan Z signing off. Have a good night.